So now that we've got all of our harnessing hooked up, all of our connections made, we've got all of our harnessing, our Gen 4 and power and communication harnesses all wrapped up nice and neatly, tucked here in this little console where we can hide it away out of everybody's way, nice and neat. Now we're gonna move on to the display mounting options. Um, today we're mounting the XD Plus in this tractor and we have XD Plus and XD screens. Our XD screens are a little bit smaller, better suited for certain applications as well as our X25s and X35s. So, but today we're going with the XD Plus and when you order our next family console kit from Topcon, it, you will receive these U-bolt ram mounting options and for certain tractors in the Deutz far line, um, anything, four cylinder tractors, these will be the mounting options of choice. There was typically a, a bar here on the B post where we can mount these two using the U-bolt, holds it all together nice and neat and very securely. But on the six cylinder tractors, we're able to utilize these sliding, um, sliding monitor mounts from SDF and these are really great. You can position them however far apart you need, multiple monitors, that kind of thing. So today we're gonna to utilize this and we're gonna plug everything into our harness that, that we have routed out of the B post. Prior to mounting the XD Plus on our RAM mount up here, we're gonna go ahead and mount our Wi-Fi adapter. It's just a simple USB connection here. So we're gonna stick it in our USB port in the back. We're gonna line our locking collar up twist it down, that locks our adapter securely in place. So on the end of the main harness, you're gonna have two connectors. You have a single key and a dual key connector. Just simply match up the right connector on the back of the display. And then using the supplied RAM mount hardware that comes with the X35 kit, we're gonna Go ahead and get it mounted here in the cab. And now we can position it to the operator's preference. Now we're ready to finish the installation by moving out to the front of the tractor and going up and mounting the receiver.